train thing worked out better than I thought. He's home studying the engineer's manual. <sighs> so peaceful without him here. Can I ask you how much that cost? $4,000 worth every penny. <laughs> Gentlemen, oh, Colonel sorry. Williams. Just wanted to see how the guidance system's coming along. Great. We found a cooling solution that allowed us to get the size of the prototype down to the target specs. As a cooling solution, it's pretty cool. <laughs> <laughs> Don't do that. <laughs> What's this? Oh, uh, nothing. Just some math we don't need. This is a different approach. Are you trying to get the guidance system even smaller? It's just a theory. Well, it's not even worked out. Oh. <laughs> I want this. <laughs> uh, but we've already met the agreed-upon specs. Going smaller would <laughs> require weeks' worth of new computations. So get the kid with the two shirts to do it. <laughs> Sir, I mean, if I may, uh, we've put a lot of thought and effort into this current prototype. It's a really elegant solution, and most importantly, it works. Yeah, I want this. <laughs> okay, but that's just a theory. It's not even a complete thought. You both make excellent points, and thank you for presenting it so articulately. <laughs> make this. <laughs> The kid with the two shirts screwed us again. <laughs> I can't believe we have to ask Sheldon to come back and help us. Oh, boo hoo. I spent four grand on a gift that only got rid of him for an afternoon. <laughs> what is that? I don't know, but if he yells, it's alive, we run. <laughs> If you knocked, I couldn't hear you. I'm welding this locomotive engine. <laughs> and if you didn't knock, how about some manners? How'd you even get that up the stairs? I said to myself, I think I can. I think I can. <laughs> and then I couldn't, so... I paid two men who promised not to come rob us later. <laughs> Okay, look, well, Sheldon, the Colonel wants us to make the guidance system smaller, and we can't do it without you. Interesting. Well, so I was right. Open a window, it's about to get smug in here. <laughs> well, I would love to help you, but since I discovered the satisfaction of working with my hands on a train engine, I don't think I can go back to theory. I'm an engineer now. <laughs> and, hey, just to be clear, a train engineer. How that goofy kind you are. 